Oh yeah, you need the sugar. Valentine's Day just four days away. And if you're looking for something sweet for your sweetie, Fill My Jar owner Annette Pardon is here with some great ideas. And this is just a feast for the eyes. Look at all of this stuff you brought in for Thanks. us. Thanks, yeah. Tell us a little bit about your business and what you brought in. So I started my business with making my own candy line mm -hmm. and then opened my store in 2021. So we'll be celebrating uh, nine years in business, but the store has only been open since uh, 2021. Okay. Um, and so with that, I delved into not only making handmade caramels and English toffees and a lot of unique barks like lemon bark, amaretto cherry almond, mm -hmm. uh, coffee crunch, but we also now make a whole line of dip treats and we make our own uh, we call them clusters. People would know them as turtles mm -hmm. um, and all fun kind of all treats like stuff. that. Yes. Okay, so now you are going to teach us how to do some dipping because, yes. you know, strawberries, you know, they bring out the romance. It's a and perfect, folks. yes. So um, get us started. What, what's your technique for dipping? So, really, for at home dippers, it's pretty easy. You can do a double boiler, which is what I have here, which is water in a pan with a bowl on top, mm -hmm. and you can melt your um, chocolate that way. You don't ever want to put water in your chocolate or get it in there. It will destroy the chocolate. Okay. Um, and then what I some fun tips and tricks, you don't have to get these. These are very cheap um, uh, pastry bags that okay. you can buy online at Amazon. You just put the um, but I buy potato chip clips oh, okay. and use them to hold them shut to make it easier to work with. And then another fun trick would be is a lot of people have a heating pad at home. Mm -hmm. Take your heating pad after you melt your candies and they can be melted here or slowly in the microwave. Okay. So 30 seconds, take it out, stir, 30 seconds, take it out, stir. Right, because you, you don't want to. You'll burn it easily, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. um, so you can buy the colored, uh, they have those colored wafers at Michael's and Joanne's, like places like that. Mm -hmm. You can buy those and make it easier, or you can buy chocolate like this, white chocolate, and then um, if you want to dye your own, I highly recommend using a powder dye versus okay. a liquid dye. So let's do one. Sure. So what you want to do, so I'm going to give you a bowl mm -hmm. here. I got some bowls ready. Okay. And what you want to do is, so these are cleaned and ready to be dipped. Okay. These were just dipped. So you want to grab your stems. Now, uh -huh. you can do it a couple of different ways. Some people like to do a toothpick in there or something yeah. like that. But you have the stem here. So yes. You just and you've got to kind of fold up all your leaves. Yeah. And you want to dip. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just so this will there. be a basic dip. Mm -hmm. Right. When you're done with this, you can let it set to dry mm -hmm. and you can add decoration. But now I have another really fun yeah, cool Yeah, talk to us about your, your decorating techniques yes. here. So another Why fun technique. Now? So I have three colors for you. You okay. can use all three, you can use two. Mm -hmm. But what you want to do is take your bags mm -hmm. and you want to take your dipping bowl and you want to squirt a nice amount in a line here. Okay. So this is kind of going to give you a tie-dye look or um, such. So I'm going to oh. do, oh, and you splooge. <laughs> oh, I'm so great at this. <laughs> no worries. That's perfectly fine because okay. it'll go right in. So, so maybe here, we'll I'll just grab take this a one. toothpick. Right. And um, yeah, I'm making quite the mess, you know, Annette. And that's good. You don't have why. to mix it in. Okay. Right. Okay. And then if you want to take a second color. Okay. And just. Um, Let me try not to uh, yeah, squeeze just it gently so pour, hard. Uh, just, just gently. I just got uh, so much uh, anxiety. Vibe and vigor over there. Out. And then okay. you want to take your um, now colors. Now this is not squeezing at all. See, oh, is, no? this one, is this one snip? Here, let's, um, yeah, it should have been, but here you go. No, no let's pour. do red. Okay, you thank you. There we go. Squeeze one too much, and the other one, not enough. There you all go. All right, here we go. You're good. Are we layering it? You're, you don't have to, I do them side by side. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, and I've then, already messed that up, <laughs> you're so that's all good. great. I don't think there's a wrong way of doing it. <laughs> And if you want to add some red, go right ahead. Since we're we're doing this, I have a feeling mine is not going to look as pretty as yours. <laughs> I don't think it'll be great. Think Honestly, so. okay. I think it'll be okay. So grab one... another strawberry. Okay. And, and you then... want to you want to grab it by your stem. Okay. And then what you want to do is you can just give it a nice dip little... it straight down. Okay. And then you want to kind of give it a give round it a nice to get it. Swirl. And then swirl oh, it up, but gently. Pretty. Look at and that. And what you'll get is some fun colors that run through. So the more color you add. The more colors you will get in your right. See how you got like streaks and yeah, I love so it. it's just kind of a fun way to. And you can get the whole family involved with this. Oh event. yeah, they're a lot of fun and it's simple. Lots of easy tricks to do at home. And if you don't want to do it at home, then 
reporter Come from us. You. Yes. Thank you so much for coming in. Great Thank to meet so you. Thank you so much. And for more information, you can visit fillmyjar.com. Also, yes. check them out on social media, and you can get the fun charcuterie boards, yes. all of the things at all your shop. Things. Yes. Great. Thank you for having me.